Oh, there we go. Oops. Oh, oh shoot, I have a uh, freaking... Yeah, I need to fix them. Like, holy cow, it's so out of place. Uh, continue. I just fix Mike though. To the north, there's a canyon surrounding the main trail. And the unimaginative locals call it the Devil's Pass. Now, reports mention possibly unknown vampiric specimens. We chalked it down to hearsay, but now we sent our top sanguisuge expert to investigate. I hope by expert you mean a field agent and not another bookworm. Scott Bloom co-wrote the Institute's Sanguisuge Vestry. We need soldiers, not pencil pushers. I can't run around looking for a missing egghead hoping that maybe he brings something to the table. When did he last report? Five days ago. Now let's just hope he's lost in research. I gotta put this on my phone first. I forgot to do that. Um, go to Twitch. Oh, back. Okay, there we go. Um, shoot, my mic is still messed up though. There, I think that's better. Oh, um, shoot. I have to go shoot or yeah. Yeah, that's better. Did I push down the hill? If I did, oops. Um. Oh, that. Oh. I thought that was, um. Another thing. Oh well. Um, oh, it's X to dodge. Was there, oh, I was going to say, was there any reason? I don't know what's going on with my sleep, it's so messed up. But whatever, I guess. Um, how do I... So. This species appears oh. to possess shape shifting abilities. It's like, yeah, I understand um, they're doing that. Microsoft. But it's like, I don't know, I don't care. Because. Well, maybe it's just me. How do I get through here? Am I supposed to? Oh. Oh, yeah. That... 
How do I do that? Um, because there was a... Hmm. It's been a long time, I don't remember the... Oh, there it is. Um, is that circle? Oh no, there we go. That was my fault. I freaking forgot what to do. Yeah, to me, high five rush, pentiment, uh, what is it? They also are gonna, re oh, grounded, that's the other game they're gonna release some PlayStation, I think it's like, um, April the 30th. Well, for Sea of Thieves, then April 12 for um, Grounded. And it's like, okay. But yeah, I th just think that bottom of the barrel exclusives. So people were saying like, oh, this will end, um, freaking, like, toxic fanboy boards. It won't. Because, okay, there's, uh, Microsoft games on, on PlayStation now, that's cool, I'm not gonna lie. What is, is that his arm freaking out? I'm just seeing if there's collectibles. Oh, I wonder if I could get back up somehow. And it's like... I don't know again, I think, um... They're just doing that. Obviously, to make people go to, uh, Xbox. Because I think, um... What is it? I just think the price is way too high on those games. Maybe it's just in, yeah, it's just in Canada, but I think they're just too high. 
Like, I know Pentamon is just 26, so it's not like huge. That uh, sort of thing. Yeah, I don't know where to go. Oh. This again costs you don't look up, goddamn. I guess I will just look up more now. I'm almost there. But yeah, I tried most of those games anyways, mostly just Sea of Thieves and, um, well, not most, but half the games, Sea of Thieves and, um, Grounded. I don't know, to me, both of those games just, net. <laughs> like, I don't know, they were just not good. It's like I know what Microsoft's trying to do, but I don't know if it will work. Because obviously they're trying to just get more players. Because, yeah, those games weren't doing great on um. Yeah, they weren't doing that great on freaking uh, Xbox, so okay, let's see if they do better on another system that's, well, arguably better. It's like, yeah, that, w like, those are my words, those are like, freaking other journalists' words, it's like, damn, freaking tell me how you really think. But obviously that's just for clickbait nonsense. Are you doing that? Seriously, screw off. Who's throwing these goddamn bar uh freaking things? They're so annoying. Over here, dumbass. 
There we go, fine. But obviously, other people feel differently. It's just me that I'm not going to get freaking Microsoft games. Ooh, that's tight. Because, like, yeah, even Sony's doing that, kind of, where it's like, yeah, not all Sony games are great. Like, I know uh, Helldivers 2 is popular, it doesn't mean that I have to like it for some reason. Because honestly, maybe it's just me, of course. But yeah, I think Helldivers 2 kind of looks boring. Obviously, with friends, it's uh, going to be so much better, but it's like. I'm taking it. Yeah, that's just the thing. It's like. You have a play, uh, that game of friends, and it's like, I don't know, I just like more single player games. Yeah, I don't think that's bad at all. Because there was a, what is it, like a Paul, like choosing if you like single players or multiplayer games on a uh, PlayStation, and most people say single player games. Because, yeah, it just is, um, uh, freaking a thing of, like, oh, you played Gosh. most of your games single player, obviously, as a kid, so you're gonna like those types of games as an adult, whatever you do. Really, whatever you do as a kid, you're gonna like as an adult, more or less. Yeah, I don't think it's that weird, honestly. So honestly, you could say it's always fanboy nonsense, it's like, okay, whatever, I don't really care. <laughs> because it's like I, yeah, weirdly, well not weirdly, I guess, but there was a point where I obviously did care. And now it's like, 
Yeah, I just kinda don't. Yeah, if, um, for example, if I was, uh, like, shooting on Pentiment or whatever, just because it's Xbox, yeah, that would be stupid. It's just... Well, a hi-fi rush is more of a game that I know I don't like. I don't know, it's just that rhythm games I don't like. Like I tried, um, what is that, Hellsinger or whatever it's called? And it's like, to me, that game was just so bad. It's like Panapon I tried um I'm pretty sure it's on PlayStation Premium. I tried it and it's like yeah, this game is not for me. It just really isn't. And it's like, I think that, like, oh, you're just a fanboy, your mark is, like, um, the go-to remark if you disagree with someone anyways. It's weird, but it's true. Because of... Again, it's just so weird being called a fanboy is like a bad word now. So weird. But I think it's more of like elementary school nonsense. Like, freaking, I, yeah, elementary school bowling nonsense, it's like, really? I don't know, it's just so messed up, I think. No, we haven't gotten past that. Like there's, 
I know they're not all adults, or gamers are not all adults, but it's like, yeah, it's like you're freaking how old and you're still acting like you're freaking 12. It's like, I don't know. To me, it's like, grow up. Oh, wait, uh, okay. I didn't know that it was a perfect thing. Oh, you have a hurry, like, really quick. There's something in the shoot. Oh. Oh, uh, challenging large enemies. Oh god, my back is itchy. Use immediately on larger enemies. So.
Yeah, I think. I don't know. Maybe. Curious me. I. It's like I don't know what a uh, Microsoft will think will happen. But I think I did obviously what they want is we can more people to play their game. Yeah, we're gonna have to wait and see if it works out though. How they want it to. Okay. Like I have uh, what I would like to do that anyways. To look more into Pentiment. Because all I know of that game, I probably will say whatever and played on my brother's xbox is like but all i know is like you run to a like run from point a to point b talking to people and then you occasionally craft things it looks like it's like that's a thrilling gameplay Yeah, I was going to play um, that again, but I think I should give it a little bit of a rest. Uh, that game being, uh, Resistance Retribution.
Where the heck did it go? Um... Yes, like I don't know what this is me. Ugh, what a stench. Where I don't know that doesn't really bother me. It's like, yeah, I don't know. Maybe that's just whatever and weird to me. Behind you, you idiot. <laughs> Oh shoot, I should have looked around first. Oh well. Is anyone there? Bloom? Is that you down there? Uh, yes, it's it's me, but who are Whoa. You're Jesse Renier, sir. Splendiferous. Care to explain what happened here, Bloom? Oh, no. uh, well, I was sent here to investigate reports of a novel breed of sanguisus. When I arrived, I encountered a group of familiars, apparently sent here by their masters. That was a familiar? How come a human turned into that thing so quickly? Well, excellent question, sir. My thesis is that their transformation is linked to the blood from these creatures somehow. The how is what I'm stuck on. Uh, we better take one of those 
things back with us to the lab. It's like I expect. Uh, well, from what I could gather, they were sent on a transport detail. Oh, Ty Captain. A of carts filled with some curious, wriggly little creatures they brought from the Callum sawmill. Uh, we need to check that place out. But yes, I expect uh, people to feel the same way about PlayStation if they put games on uh, Where are you off to in such a hurry? Bar Xbox. Yes. When we dragged your dad in here, there was an awful lot of blood on him. He'll be fine. Bastard's too damn stubborn to die. I've seen my share of battle wounds. The ones William got. No way even half of that came out of him alone. Somewhere between the falling airships and hopping boo hags, I don't know. Could be that collateral damage wasn't the tick's only objective. Could be they... They infected him? No. No fucking way. Just hold your horses and just think about it. The Institute is infiltrated, and they'll let both you and William walk away? Jess, when a tick turns a familiar... They form a sort of bond. The sire can see into the servant's mind. Now, they make that link with, say, the man who developed that weapon you're carrying. Edgar, our orders are clear when folks get infected. Infected means dead. Those are his own words. Breathe. Run and take a sip of water. Remember that crap I brought from Lake Morapass? That plant that was supposed to be a base for a cure one day. I'm not gonna gamble my father's life on some swamp nerd's magic potion. It's not like we got a handful of aces here, Jess. Dabano and his lunatic spawn had taken the fight to us. And I sure as hell don't want to go to war without our general. Do you? All right. The plant might be back in the manor's ruins. I'll go check if there's anything left of the lab, and you... I go. You need to take care of the gauntlet. I don't give a flying fuck about the gauntlet. I'm not sitting on my ass while my father grows a new set of teeth. And no one asks you to. But if I fail, you and that gauntlet will be the only thing between us and a war we can't win. I got this, okay? Just keep an eye on that nosy lady doctor. And stay close to William, just in case I don't make it back in time. Okay, there we go. Yeah, I think I'm obviously still a little whatever, but it's like, yeah, you should be able to like or dislike a game without being called a fanboy, to be honest, but whatever. I guess people are just really do live sad lives. Some people. Oh. March eighteen sixty six. But I guess that's yeah, their problem, not mine. Yeah, this would be obviously a saloon, and they had uh, like prostitutes. I don't know, I'm not really into westerns. Like, there's an exception, there's always that exception. I 
Like I think. Good to see you back, sir. Be careful there, Mr. Influencer. Verge is working. A silence before a storm. For sure. Uh -huh. Oops, um... Oh, I completely forgot about that. Um, God damn it. Um, is there anything I'm looking for a collect was I guess not. Um, am I going down? No. With the rentiers and that Harrow guy here, is Dr. Blackwell still calling the shots? I'm sure the government visited the manor often, but Mr. Harrow's not an ape. Um... Oh... There's a bunch of money there, god damn it. That's what worries me. 
It's not something you can walk the street um. without. We've been fighting each other for centuries. Like every other creature, they change over time to get an upper hand against us. Yeah, is there anything? No. Until recently, the Sanguisuge reproduced by turning their familiars. A slow but effective process. Now there's this new breed. So what is this? Popping up like rabbits. They're fierce and resourceful. But still not anything we can class as an evolutionary step up the ladder. Well, if anything, they're a step backwards. Mindless and bloodthirsty. They're cannon fodder. But this is Debano's idea of an army. Humans turn to minions or whatever foul blood beast they'll know. Okay, it's so one in fifty two minutes, so go another. Well, I guess to know for sure we have to investigate McCallum's soul. However long like an hour and some an hour and eight minutes I think. Time to check up on our resident genius god why do i have to be such a pig paper paper everywhere i can't find shit in here oh hi holy moly where are my notes <clears throat> as we all know Faraday's mutual induction phenomenon. Virgil, take it easy with the jargon, please. You're talking to a field agent. <sighs> Diamagnetism, polyphase system. Uh, you sure you don't want to hear my radiography joke about... Uh, never mind. Here it is. Long story short, I reverse engineered the disruptor mechanism and identified the problem. Its energy consumption is off the charts. Best engineer in the Institute, huh? Well, before you jump down his throat, perhaps we can give Virgil a chance to explain himself. Miniaturization has its limits. If you want a working disruptor like this, you have to accept the okay. fact that it won't be, well, portable. Like Amelia so kindly pointed out, I'm a field agent, as in I go out in the field. If the gauntlet's not portable, it's useless. Now, I don't mean to put your ass over the fire, but... Apparently you do. But... If we don't get it running, we're all done for. Can you make it work? Well, maybe if I could somehow get my hands on some spare coils from the original disruptor... Done. Where can I find them? Yeah, so I can't really... ...a visual anomaly in a mining town called Baxter. It turned out to be a glamour. Director Rentier sent me there to deliver a crate of heavy electrical coils. They were designed to help our engineers disrupt the illusion. Unfortunately, before the team could collect any relevant data, the cell was destroyed by the ticks. Whatever they were hiding must have been important. They left no one alive. How will I know these coils, Birch? Just look for a miniaturized electrical resonance. Okay, resonance. okay, that's not gonna work. Pack your shit, kid. We're out in five. Yeah, I probably will. Go down first and clear the way. Try not to get killed or Blackwell skin me alive. R Roger that, Mr. Jesse. Um, Gordon Wake. March, so, April. And that's like Gordon Week is um around late April, May, right? So it's February, March, April, so yeah, about two, three months away. And, um, yeah, by that time, I'm probably gonna do that um get uh what is it octopath traveler 2 and uh labyrinth uh i forget what it's called labyrinth of something Uh, Clover Society or something. Uh, 
like it's the next um, labyrinth of refrain game. Yeah, it's a labyrinth of refrain. Coven of Dusk is the first game, then the second game is like I think Coven Society or something like that. Yeah, I'll probably get those two games. Ah, uh, freaking That came in Octopath Traveler 2. Whoa, obviously think about it. Uh, for sure I get a... Uh, that... Labyrinth of Refrain, or whatever it's called. But Octopal Traveler 2, I don't know. Because the first one I didn't like. I think I just didn't like the first game because... I know it's like whatever, but yeah, I just thought it was too hard. But I think now you can change the difficulty. I could be wrong on that. Maybe I need to play the... Yeah, I don't need to play the game because you search it up if you could change the difficulty. And yeah, if you can, I just... They must have transported them somewhere down those rails. We'll be whatever. Left huh. But if you can't, then oh well. I guess I skipped it. That kind of sucks, though. I'm not gonna lie. Um, how do I go to the other one?
My nose, of course, man. Holy cow. This is a lot of zitchy. Eighteen ninety Baxter. So there's probably nothing more here. Yeah, it's one of three. I'll probably stop after this because why not? And I'm just trying to understand that. It's like, yeah, I guess everybody likes playing games differently, but. Still, that does not make any sense to me. Like, I mean, if a game doesn't have physics, it's like, why is that game w um bad? It's like, whatever, I guess. But I think that's like... Yeah, people that um, just like graphics too much. It's just weird how people uh, do that. Then kind of say one thing then How would I do that? to Stop. the opposite, more or less. I don't know, it's a mister indeed. Because it's like, oh, frickin', um, yeah, I don't mean to, it's just, yeah, I just find it really frickin' weird that he says 30 frames doesn't look bad, but when, um, 
a game freaking is too realistic and doesn't add uh, physics, it's like then the game's bad. It's like that's the same thing, more well, more or less, not the exact same, but more or less. You're still obsessing about graphics. I mean, cause I don't know, maybe it's just me, but I think obviously physics are a part of graphics. And I don't know, I think he's just trying to find any excuse at this point to say he's gonna quit gaming and like why do you need a fighting excuse if you just wanna quit then quit like you don't need an excuse or well, whatever That's a rusty shortcut, Verge. Well... Well, maybe that's me. Of course it's not working. Luckily, you have a faithful sidekick who can kickstart that thing. But I guess a lot of people do that, just make up excuses. But I don't know, maybe it's me. At the end of the day, it's like, why? I can't get up there. But, oh well.
gotta squeeze through. Oh, he's here. I'm taking oh, it. There was that over here, okay. That's tight. Even though it's not much, it's still something. Oh, I need to get all three of them. Oh crap, that's annoying. Oh well. So the second one is like here, but how do I get there? Because I can't climb up, can I? Is it through here? Hmm. Gotta squeeze through. Or through. I can squeeze through there. Yeah, I understand it's up there, but how do I get up there? Oh, there we go. That was not uh, freaking clear at all, but whatever. Oops, I didn't. Yeah, that sucked. I didn't know that was going to be one animation to just slide down. Um, oh wait, okay. what miss that? Are you serious? How the hell? Oh, there's a zip line, but I can't use it. Shoot. Well, more or less. I think I... Go all the way up here, then I somehow go over there. Of course. Yeah, I'll try to ignore that other edge. God damn. I How do we move? Okay, I did know all that and yes. Do we Oh Well Okay. Uh, 
Yeah, look here first, because I probably will uh, freaking jump down after I turn that on. And there was only that there. It worked, Mr. Jesse. I can see that, you know. Any, I don't know about the Borderlands movies, like. Yeah, it just seems like whatever. Like a movie that really doesn't take itself seriously. Uh, sir, are you sure about this? You said down those rails is a Okay. Uh, maybe the that was weird. The freaking minecarts just disappear. Um. So if I get in, oh, I was afraid it was going to be some dumb. Oh great, it is some dumb freaking bullshit. Ah, uh, that was what exactly what I was afraid of. That it would be some dumb bullshit. And my fears were just that. Oh my god. Done. Well, my fears came to life, I guess. See? Doesn't it auto freaking aim? I think, um, I should. Yeah, I should mute this part because, god damn, this is such a bad part. Like, this is a hugely bad part. Alrighty.
done. Oh my god, this part is so bad, but I'm gonna give it three more tries. If I don't do it, I'm just exiting the game. It's like, sorry, but whatever. A uh, one? Well, it's mainly because I'm really bad at aiming, but whatever, one. Uh... Okay, two. Well, I was, uh, freaking reloading right when I was supposed to shoot, so... I'll see that someone again. Okay, two. <laughs> because I'm so bad at aiming. I wish you would, uh... I call that a mulligan. I'll just do it one more time, then I'll end. Because goddamn, like... I'll... Against my better gym, and I do it one more time. Just one more. Okay, I'll do that again. I call that a mulligan because that stupid, uh, freaking thing was in my way. That piece, like that two by four. <laughs> It's like, um, I'll do it this time without aiming, see if that's better. Yeah, no, it's not better. Well, maybe I just fucked up, who knows. Yeah, no, it's not any better. That worked. Oh, come on, I had it. Alrighty. So, yeah, the best strategy is hopefully you'll get super lucky and just hit it. Okay, yeah, I'm done. I'm done. I, I'm done. I, I just don't know what to say. I'm done. Like, it sucks that I, um... Uh, done. Freaking... I didn't do this. Like, I'm... Stuck at this place. It sure does suck. I'm not gonna lie. But... Yeah. 
Yeah, that part is just garbage. Holy cow. But anyway, this is just end. Uh, yeah, I guess, whatever. If I don't beat this game, I don't beat it. It's like, it's, uh, yeah, it's a PlayStation Plus game. It's like, yeah, like, slowly and slowly I'm becoming like that. It's like, if I don't beat a game, it's like, eh, I don't really care. Like, if I would have purchased this game, like, outright, then yes, I would care. Because... I would be spending more money. But, yeah, I don't really care. But anyway, just stop laughing and actually stop. Uh, yes.